Yeah. What's something you haven't accomplished musically that you want to accomplish? Um, I most definitely want to win everything that all the musicians before me won, like Grammys and, you know, just VMAs. I feel like we need some of that, and that's mm -hmm. it. And just keep making good music, more platinum records, more number ones. Mm -hmm. So I know you produce as well, and I was talking to my friend Gabe, who is somewhere, he's right there, um, before this interview, just things that he'd want to know from about you. And he was like, okay. Oh, see these Gabe questions. Yeah, yeah, this one is Gabe's question. I liked it, I was like, I'm gonna ask, I'm gonna right, answer Gabe. this. Yeah. <laughs> he said, okay, so if we gave Migo, or if we gave Quavo and the Migos this like old school type beat, and he can put three people on it, what beat would you choose? Like as a sample, what beat would you pick? And who would the features be? All uh, old school? No, I think new school people, old school people too, yes. Okay, uh, most definitely be a James Brown beat. Um, any one of those beats, cause he, most definitely had the hip hop sound. Mm -hmm. um, and who would I get on it? Uh, I did so many songs with so many people. Uh, I get Jay Z on it. I get Jay Z, Kanye, and uh, Kanye and Drake. <laughs> Jay-Z, Kanye, and Drake all on one song. I'm sure that would be an interesting song Yep. for a variety of ways. But I mean, I think if three of those people are on a song, I don't really think you, it could go Can't wrong. Lose. The final product wouldn't go wrong. I don't know about the creation of the song, but the final, <laughs> the, <laughs> the final product, it'd be, though. It would take a long time to come out, but we can't lose. <laughs> it would take a long time to come out, for sure. But uh, what's it sound like? What's it sound like? I'm not asking you to rap this time, but just give me what what that song sounds like. Cause I think it's really interesting that you produce, but I don't feel like you talk about the fact that you produce a lot. I don't know what it sounds like. I'm just, if I'm just the producer, I just yeah. want, I'm gonna just cook the beat and I just want you to just lay this track. I just want you to just go in. You gotta come to the studio. So you don't know a lot about me. You got to. Yeah, I don't know about the studio. You know about I'm, a sports, like. I'm a sports, I'm a sports girl. You listen girl. to the music, you just say the words. You gotta come in and watch the, have you ever been to like um, Benny Hunter? Yes, of course. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? The bocce bus, you did what I'm saying? They cook it in front of you. So we cook it in front of you, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You can watch it. You can watch me cook it in front of you. Okay. We got your chicken, your steak, your fried rice, extra egg, no vegetables. Okay. <sighs> stir fry? Got to cook it like it's stir fry. <laughs> then that DJ The Real gonna bring, make the beat? Yeah. Oh my God. So That's the season. What is, okay, so you talk about the studio. Tell me the experience of being in the studio at Quavo. I've heard a bunch of things of what it's like to be in the studio with DJ Khaled. I hear it is just luxurious. He mm. does whatever, and, and it's just a great time. Yeah, studio with Quavo. No, my studio session is not like that at all. Okay. Um, I won't come no more. No, I'm just kidding. It's not <laughs> Tell like me that what at it's all. Like. It's, uh, it's just some good vibes, all of us in there. It's very cloudy, you know? Um, okay. The room is very cloudy. Do you write better high? I just said the room is cloudy. I write better. Do you in write the, better I write when it's better, cloudy? I write better in the sky. Yeah. Okay. I write better in the sky, and um, <laughs> and um, I just make sure, like, I just make sure that somebody got some crazy beats, and then I'm just ready to go. Like, when you see me, you'll be like, "Damn, that shit crazy," because you really make a song in 25 minutes. Yeah. I make a song in like 25 minutes. I only got to do the first hook and the verse. Mm -hmm. You know, the rest of the boys come in and go crazy. Yeah. And vice versa, they do the same. 